Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. My name is Karen, we are in the month of July which means that today we are opening the new So Kawaii box. So I can't believe we're already in July, it's just crazy isn't it? But at least the sun's shining now and it looks like summer might actually be back at least for a little while so that makes me super excited. But yeah, today we are going to be opening the latest So Kawaii box together. So without further ado, let's just get straight in there. What are we hoping for from this month's box? Let me know in the comments right now before we even get in there what you would like to see. For me, I want a, a plushie is the main thing because I'm trying to build up my little collection. So if we get a plushie, then I'll be happy. And other than that, I mean, I've not been disappointed yet. So I reckon whatever we get. I'll be happy with so yeah but yeah let me know if there's anything in particular that you want to see Pokemon's always a winner as well <laughs> so if we get a bit of Pokemon then even better all right so we're going in I'm not even going to give you a sneaky peek I'm going to save it all as a surprise so as we do every month we will look at the little leaflet first off just to see what the sort of theme is for this month and what we can expect so we are in july and as you can see on here the theme for this month is enchanting matsuri so thank you so much for ordering this july edition so kawaii you are welcome experience a japanese festival and celebrate summer's arrival with this enchanting matsuri themed box each summer traditional festivals called matsuri are held all around japan this box is featuring your much-loved characters from Sanrio, Pokemon, and San X licenses. Once again this month, we did our blah, blah, blah. So, okay. So we know we're getting Pokemon, we're getting Sanrio, so it's all already looking like a winner. So, yeah, I, because I can see on here, sneaky peek, <laughs> what we're getting. Yeah, okay. Looks good, looks good. Um, so, let's just get in there and start from the top and see... What we're getting for july okay so the first thing on top of the box is this oh cute it's this little tray so it looks again like bamboo so if you remember we had the little bowl a couple of months back i think it was and um, the bamboo bowl so this looks like a bamboo tray and um, with the rylakuma on there so are oh, very cute and they are eating some nice little snacks on there and then we got this little this little duck guy who's wearing what looks like a jacket and like a little a little bow on there as well. That's cute. We've got some like Japanese writing on here as well. So let's have a look on the leaflet what it says. So I'll hold this up here. Rylakuma bamboo fibre tray. So this cute little Rylakuma bamboo tray will add a touch of kawaii to your room while keeping your desk or table clean. It's made out of bamboo fibre and features a lovely and original design of Rylakuma and friends enjoying a summer Matsuri. Okay, so they are at the summer party at the Matsuri and they're eating, oh, what is this? Looks like a toffee apple, can, candy floss maybe? Or maybe some ice cream, I don't know. Um, looks like a chocolate banana and a toffee apple there with some little goldfish. So that is cute. Um, oh, look at the fireworks as well. You can see like the characters in the fireworks. I love that. I love that detail. So that, yeah, that is just, <laughs> say it with everything, but that is just cute. So that'll probably go in this room somewhere and yeah, just use it for like organizing and, and making the place look nice. So yeah, that's our first item. Okay, next up, um, let's just literally go in the order that they're here. So we've got Pocket Monsters, so our little Pokemon item here. Not entirely sure, it's got a zip around it, so let's get it out of the plastic packaging and have a closer look to see what this is. Okay, ooh, it feels kind of, I don't know, it's soft, but not like how you'd normally describe so I don't know it's just it feels nice <laughs> so it's got this zip on here okay that's a bit strange the zips like just around there so it doesn't go all the way around okay now it's soft inside so that's probably what I can sort of feel through there so oh look at that it's just like fuzzy you can already see because look I can like write in there 
um, but it's dirt, fuzzy on the inside. Um, on, on the outside, so we've got Lapras, um, we've got a little Pikachu riding up there on his head, and then we've got the gang down here having a blast. So we've got a little Charmander, Squirtle, and Bulbasaur down there as well. So they're just having a whale of a time by the looks of it. Um, so let's have a little read up and see what it says. So, Pokemon Pouch. Um, this officially licensed Pokemon Pouch is as useful as beautiful with an adorable design from the CPU Graffiti collection. It's perfect for holding all of your stationery cards or even cosmetics and accessories. Another cute item to add to your Pokemon collection. Yeah, so I don't know what I put. I don't think I put cosmetics in there because I feel like it would just ruin the, the softness inside. What else does it say? Stationery cards. Um, I think actually, like I know it sounds a bit stupid, but like you could put your phone in there because I just like carry my phone wherever. I'll have it with me and just like throw it in my bag or whatever and then just end up getting it scratched and ruined. Um, but that'd be quite cute. So you could literally just put your phone in there and protect it. I don't know. Multi-purpose. So definitely add that to my collection because I do have a little bit of a Pokemon collection. But yeah, so that is cute. Yeah, so Pokemon pouch. I'm not sure, did it say? I'm not sure if there are different designs. I'm assuming there probably is, but I don't know. So again, if you've got this month's box and you've got a different design, let me know which characters you got on yours. But yeah, all having fun, having a brilliant time. Okay, next up we've got some Hello Kitty kitchen sponges. So I think probably pretty much do what they say on the box there so um yeah so two little hello kitty sponges um do you know what i was gonna get them out but i have a bit of a weird thing about sponges i don't like these type i just i do not like how they feel <laughs> is, that, is that weird i don't know but it just goes through me it's like the like the whole chalkboard thing like scratching the chalkboard or oh, it just goes through me so i'm not actually going to get them out of the pack just yet so we'll read off <laughs> let me know if i'm weird i know i am anyway but whatever and um, so it says on here replace your boring old kitchen sponge with, with this cute sanrio sponge set it's quite practical they like that don't they cute and practical in these boxes which is just awesome um both sponges are die cut and printed with lovely my melody or hello kitty designs perfect for washing up dishes and general cleaning so i don't i don't want to use them they're too cute they're just yeah, they're too cute for washing the dishes. <laughs> I might just put them in the kitchen as like decoration or something because they're lovely. Um, but yeah, so it says there are different designs. So the Hello Kitty ones and then there are Sanrio ones as well. So um, yeah, but I like them. <laughs> they're cute. They are. Um, so yeah, that's our next item. Again, cute and practical. Can't go wrong, can you? Okay, next item. <sighs> We're getting through these quickly today. Um, so this, okay. I'm gonna need a little bit of help with this. So, what, are, what is it? Oh, do you know what? I think I saw this on the So Quiet Instagram page. I'm sure this is a fan. Um, but let's get it out with this plastic bag so we can have a closer look. All right, so let's just look at those characters there so how cute is that design that's gorgeous just like the the pastel colors um, and obviously it's an ice cream shape <laughs> which makes it just so much better um, so let's have a quick read first and then we can open it up and have a closer look so it is a Sumiko Gurashi electric fan. Yeah, so I was right, it was the fan. I remember seeing it, I was like, ooh, that's kind of different, but also really useful for like today's weather because it's boiling out there. So yeah, okay. To keep cool awesome along with this amazing Sumiko Gurashi original fan. The fan is a must have if you go to a Mitsuri during summer in Japan. It's designed to look like a delicious ice cream cone. Yeah, so I have been to Japan in summer. I was actually there two years ago today. 
I was in Tokyo and it was very warm so I could have done with this then <laughs> um, but yeah I'm gonna open it up actually and just see if I can get this working and, and show you what, what it's like um, when it's actually doing what it's supposed to do okay so I've just taken out of its packaging and unfortunately it needs some batteries and a teeny tiny screwdriver <laughs> to get into the back so I I will later on go and sort that out but at the minute I don't even know if I've got any batteries to fit that and um, but this is it out of the packaging anyway so you can just see it a little bit closer in terms of what it looks like this part here so the front flips open um, you can see the fan through there um, and then there's also this little string as well so you can tie the string in the top so how cool is that I love that and like I say the design is just so cute and again cute and practical so yeah awesome again let me know if you've had a different design or anything because I always like to know what other people get and what the other options are but I'm always super happy um, with everything I get anyway but yeah so that was our little fan and I think we're moving on to the last item already okay so last but not least we do have a plushie so yeah i'm not disappointed i knew we would i knew it we couldn't we couldn't have a so quiet box without a little plushie could we so let me just get into the bag and get this out so this is our little plushie here um and she's also got um i don't really know like a a chain thing on her so you can i don't know we wouldn't put it on your keys would you you never lose your keys with that on <laughs> but yeah so let, let's have a quick read i've lost my sheet under everything Where are you? there we go so this is a little twin stars plush enjoy the magic of japanese summer festivals all year long with one of these amazing little twin star matsuri yukata plushies it's made out of soft plush fabric and features a lovely traditional yukata outfit get either kiki or lala at random in your box okay oh, again i don't i don't know which one's kiki which one's lala which one is this oh, so it says little twin stars on our unicorn we fly in the starry sky on a dreamy night of sweet delight i need to look into this a little bit more this sounds like my kind of thing it mentioned unicorns so definitely um, so it is a Sanrio character and yeah I'm going to look a little bit more into this little twin stars because I'm not familiar um, and the the plushie on the leaflet is the one that we've got here and um, so I'm not sure what the other one looks like but yeah that's cute um, I need a bit of pink I think for my collection over here so it's looking a bit looking a bit dark just here so she will go nicely somehow onto my plushie collection we'll have to find a, a nice little home she go there look at that we're building we are building the collection we've got baby grogu baby yoda over here and then we've just got to fill this gap so that is the aim for the rest of this year is to get this gap behind me filled um but yeah that was the last item so as always let me know what was your favorite and i'll do a quick recap so i'll put a little photo or video or something of all the items that we got here so you can just have a quick look um in terms of my favorite item i think it's got to be the fan hasn't it it has to be it's just it's so cute it's so practical and i just love it i'm gonna get it working later i promise um yeah that's got to be my favorite for this month but yeah let me know in the comments which was your favorite item let me know if you've had this box and you've had any anything different so any different designs or anything and yeah i'm already excited for next month so that was lovely that was a little pick me up today i think and the sun shining outside and get my fan working get a real ice cream and just go and sit outside and, and chill now so oh yeah, awesome okay well thank you so much for joining me once again as you know i love doing these unboxings every month never disappointed and yeah i'm excited to see what we get in august already and um, the year is just flying by isn't it but yeah leave me a comment down below come and chat to me if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up 
and go and hit that subscribe button because most of you guys watching are still not subscribed so you know what to do all right okay so that brings us to the end of today's video i will be back hopefully next week i am gonna try and upload every friday it's just been a bit a bit of a strange few weeks so i've been a little bit late with videos but i'm gonna try and upload every friday so new videos coming your way every week any suggestions let me know and yeah until then you guys take care i love you all and i will see you again soon in the next video Mwah. goodbye